so I'm in my room on the ferry, on my way. Finally made it on the ferry. Seemed like such a long day. I'm going to show you about the room. Show you what these ferry rooms are like. Um, quite small. That's the entrance door. TV. Bunk beds. Very small table. And in the bathroom. And shower. All you need really for one night. It's quite good. You uh, you can't travel on these ferries at night time without having a cabin. So I went for the cheapest option. This is the cheapest option. And uh, it's not too bad. It's all right. Funny thing, funny fact. But wooden walls. Watch. <laughs> I'm sorry, it tickled me. I don't know. I don't think it's very wooden. Thin veneer over a steel hull, I think. But uh, there we go. Anyhow, it must be time for me to get some sleep. I've got 6 30 for some breakfast. And then the cycling begins. Anyway, so I'm on my way. Just found out that Holland's an hour ahead, so I'm going to lose an hour's sleep as well. <sighs> hey ho, should be there soon. Looking forward to it, I think. I think. Anyhow, the light switch here somewhere. We've left the harbour now. You can just about hear the engines. I'm at the good end of the ship, I'm at the front of the ship, so the engines are quite a long way away, which is nice. <laughs> Hopefully, I'll get some sleep. Anyway, see you all in the morning. Okay. arrived. Uh, the ferry is about one kilometre back that way. And I'm going to put in some miles. And miles and miles and miles. This is lovely. It's really quiet and gorgeous. Nobody else about I'm If the shirt's a bit bright. It's so quiet. Lovely. Gorgeous day. Just birds everywhere. Really, really enjoying this. I've hardly gone anywhere yet. 
think I've done about eight miles or something like that. Eight miles, what's that? Twelve kilometres? I'll try and keep it in kilometres, I think. Oh, there's another cyclist. Had to stop to take the coat off. It's getting warm already. It's going to be a hot day. Very, very sunny. Can't complain about that though. Who said Holland's flat? <laughs> Look at this. Sand dunes everywhere. Up and down, up and down, up and down. Excuse my pronunciation on all these if anybody's watching from Holland. I have no clue. Anyway, I'll stop there waiting for a good friend to uh, turn up. Yep, twice. Hopefully I'll be here in a few minutes. Meanwhile, I'm sitting in the sun enjoying the view of the sea. Gorgeous, gorgeous day. Can't buy my sunglasses. Not clever. Beautiful. Really, really lovely day. Hope it carries on like this. Uh, 43 kilometers so far. Yes. a herring stand and I think this is one right here I'm gonna let him try some herring because he's never had some before okay you can get it on bread if you're hungry or just just naked just herring with some onions on it how are you having it oh, I never eat this <laughs> yeah that's it I'm gonna go first so I don't eat this very often there you go but anyway, see if I still like it. See if there are no seagulls, huh? Okay. I think so. And? I like it. It's pretty good. Really? It's nice. Fishy. Yeah. My turn then. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what am I doing? <laughs> Oh, slimy. Yeah, it's very slimy. <laughs> Watch out, it doesn't slip out of your hands. Oh. There you go. Big bite. <laughs> oh, it's not bad at all. It's not bad. No. Oh. It's quite good. Awesome. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. Alright, 
So I wanted to do a little uh, talk here about, because we just made a picture with this lighthouse right here. So okay, could you tell me, like, wh why? Why did you want a picture with this lighthouse? Yeah, uh, there's a route using the LF route around uh, the Netherlands. 1300 kilometers long, it's called, in English, around the Netherlands, surprisingly. Wow, that's a very good name. Yeah, and uh, there's six positions around the Netherlands that you have to take a photograph of yourself. You send it to the organization at the end of it, and uh, they will send you a certificate to uh, prove that you... Yeah, you don't get anything else, like uh, no. money or something. <laughs> Could be, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> well, your first um, memory of the flower fields, losing the drone, it's a bummer. Yeah, it sucks. Yeah, but I'm gonna give uh, him my drone for the remainder of his trip and uh, he's actually gonna go back to the UK one day before I start my tour, so then he can hand it over to me, if he's careful. <laughs> uh, Right, so oh. this is this really helped me out today. Big, big help. So it's really, really good. Uh, gonna leave yeah. a, uh, this guy's fantastic. Get on his channel. I'll link it. This is gonna be a big YouTuber, so keep uh, keeping in mind that. I'm gonna leave a uh, link in the description to his channel. Bye! Fifteen minutes ago, he's headed home. I've still got about another fifteen kilometres to go to get to my campsite for tonight. Really enjoyable day. Thank you, Thomas. Really, really nice bloke. It's been a really good day, despite the obvious downer. But uh, anyhow, these things happen. Thanks, Thomas. Really, really good day. guys well that's the end of day one about 52 miles 84 kilometers I think it was had a good day despite the bad news losing the drone it was still a very good day enjoyed uh, messing around with Tice and uh, yeah made the day very very tired now. Looking forward to some good sleep. So uh, yeah, that's about it for today and uh, see you in the morning. Good night.